am on day 1289. Oh, 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 mm. Welcome to another OMAD blog. I'm Dr. Erica and I have lost and kept off 60 pounds for over three years through intermittent fasting and also through exercise. I also like to help encourage and motivate you while you're on your journey. If that sounds like something you're interested in, sis, go ahead and click the subscribe button and join the family. I promise you'll love it here. Today is Monday, January the 22nd and I am ready to have an amazing day. Today Today, I am on day 1289, 1289 days in a row of me, your girl, showing up for herself every single day because see, I made myself a priority. I am definitely important and self-care is not selfish. It's actually necessary. So are you looking for an accountability partner? Girl, that's why I am here. Not only do I show up for myself every day, I show up for you as well. You know, making these daily blogs. See, I'm going to hype you up. I'm going to gas you up. I'm going to be your biggest cheerleader, making you believe you can do anything you put your mind to because you can. Now, I know it is someone out there that's ready to start their health and wellness journey. So if I'm talking to you, girl, I need you to do one thing because see, not only am I the queen of consistency, your girl is also the queen of walking in place. So go ahead, stand up, start walking in place, watch this entire vlog, and guess what? Your exercise, your activity, your workout for day one is done. Congratulations on making today, this day, your day one. You know, the start of your health and wellness journey. Now, girl, you just have to keep going. Start showing up and showing out because that's what we do. Start shining bright like a diamond because like I said, you are important. So make yourself a priority. Now it's time for me to head downstairs and get my workout in here. Girl, come on. So I just got done working out and best free and girl, you already know it was a good one, but you know how this works as well. Girl, go ahead. Tell me how was your workout? You know, I want to know what time you're working out, what kind of workout you're going to do, how long you're going to work out for. Girl, what are you watching? What are you listening to? Because you know, we like to stay entertained while we're working out. Girl, just tell me anything there is to know about your workout because that's what accountability partners do and that's what we are. So just in case you did know, once you click that subscribe button, and girl, 
<laughs> we are locked, girl. I will forever be showing up for you just as much as I show up for myself. We are uh, accountability best friends. So Jessica said, girl, mine was good, but I must say, let's start here. My sleep score was only an 80, which is kind of low for me because y'all know usually I'm in like the mid to high 80s, sometimes on occasion 90s, you know, and so, um, you know, at first I was like, hmm, I'm not sure why, why I like the low sleep score, but nevertheless, I was still able to come down here and crush my workout so i started out on my treadmill i did my five minute um warm up was my walk and then your girl busted out six miles this morning um you know i wanted to go longer i feel like i could have gone longer but i must say girl i did it in um a little over 10 minutes okay so i shaved um about a minute off of that time per mile so i am excited about that so i was running faster this morning i'm trying to get back down you know to that nine minute mile you know because that's where i used to be you know a couple of years ago before i you know kind of took a break from running so did the six miles then after i got done running um my cardio so i got off i picked up my five pound dumbbell and i just did like my little upper body movements girl because you know i've been saying for the past little bit girl we're trying to keep it right and tight we getting summertime fine and these summer bodies are made in the winter girl i'm trying to stay ready though so i don't have to get ready okay so then i just ended with my little cool down and stretch so what was i watching so i started off on youtube i was watching a few running videos which girl we're gonna talk about that in a minute okay so i was watching a few running videos and then i went on over there to bravo because i need to catch up on my merit to medicine and my housewives of potomac so i was a couple episodes behind so i watched one of each so one episode of merit to medicine and then one episode of um of the housewives of potomac because y'all already know i've been on my love and marriage uh hospital so i had gotten a little bit behind on you know on my other shows so that was my workout and just like i said girl it was a good one but let's go ahead and talk about these running videos so last night girl after we talked last night remember i ate my little food and everything you know girl i got went down this rabbit hole okay i didn't got on youtube i am watching these running videos so just in case you are new here girl i have been a runner since girl 1999 2000 okay a very long time i've had periods where you know i'll go you know a year or two of running and then i may take a little break for some months or some years and then i get back into it but i initially started running a long time ago girl and um now it's just here i am again going through this period in my life where i'm getting back into my running so um you know what i don't want to get into a full conversation now we may have to save this for the midday check-in but just know your girl went down the rabbit hole girl and i'm feeling a little itch i'm feeling a little itch okay about a major race but we'll talk about that just like i said during our midday check-in right about now it is time for me to head upstairs go ahead start drinking on this water because yes it's monday you know i have to get um us out of here to school and to work but girl go ahead check in let me know about your workout and we'll just we're gonna we're gonna catch back up during the midday check-in one more thing before I head upstairs to start drinking on this water, I did not mention my fasting schedule. So, you know, we're at the start of a new week. So this will be another week of my modified alternate day fasting. So today will be a down day where I have my small 500 calorie meal once I get back home. And then on tomorrow, of course, that's that'll be my up day where I have, you know, basically like two meals. So I just want to touch on that real quick. You know, uh, once again, you'll, you know, see that later on the video if i decide to have my zero calories or my 500 calories but more than likely your girl gonna be going in with the 500 calories all right now let me head upstairs and start drinking on this water hey girl it is time for our midday chicken girl you already know this is one of my uh favorite times of the day where i can check in with my best friend girl how is your morning going girl we we are uh, checking on a uh, mental health over here okay how is your morning going girl also let me know how are you doing with your water um if you are behind go ahead take a couple of sips right now sis we got to stay hydrated we want the glowing skin we want the energy we want all the things all the benefits that water brings okay and then also how are you doing with your steps girl if you are behind what am i about to say go ahead stand up right now start walking in place because you know that's the cheat code okay and then also if you are a faster girl girl how is your fast going you know have you been feeling hungry at all or not you know let us know how long you're going to be fasting for today and then if you are about to break your fast girl 
What are you eating? Drop it in the comments because you just never do know who may be getting their next meal idea from what you are eating. Girl, tell us anything there is to know about how your morning is going. So how has your best friend been doing? Okay, so as far as my water, girl, I'm actually doing really good over here. So I am almost halfway through. So I'm going to count it as a win, okay? We're just chugging right on along, okay? So this hopefully will be a day that I definitely can reach my goal of my gallon. And then as far as my steps right now, I just hit 14,000 steps. And the majority of that came from this morning where I did that run because here's the thing, today is a down day. So I'm trying to, you know, as much as I can, you know, just kind of relax. Okay, girl, I'm not doing any walking in place over here today. And then as far as my fast, so right now it is 1246 and I'm feeling really good right now. Um, that means I'm over 16 um, hours fasting, but remember, I'm not necessarily counting the hours because today will just be my little down day of 500 calorie meal, a 500 calorie meal. But I must say, girl, around 10 something, your best friend started feeling a little hungry. I'm talking about like hungry, hungry, okay? And I was thinking like, wait a minute now, I just ate those black eyed peas yesterday. This is not like normal. So what did I do? I went in there, I made a cup of black coffee and I started drinking my water. And now, just got said, feeling really good so I guess that was just like a little wave of hunger that your best friend experienced okay but no I'm doing really really good so how has my morning been girl we have actually been extremely busy over here busy to the point um though just like I said I have been able to drink my water um but extremely busy and um I'm not complaining about that because if you remember girl we had some days on last week where we were really really slow so no complaints at all it definitely made the morning go by really fast so girl remember this morning i was telling you like we was going to talk on the midday check-in about um some of these thoughts that i was having okay and i know i may have been a little vague but it's fine because just like i said i didn't really want to get into it this morning but here we are now so y'all know yesterday girl okay so let's talk about it okay so you know yesterday how we didn't have sunday dinner so what did your girl do after i finished taking care of everything i need to take care of you know um around the house I sat down and I did what we normally do. Girl, we got on YouTube, okay? And why did y'all let me go down this rabbit hole of looking at running videos? And not any old kind of running videos. Girl, I'm looking at marathon videos. Girl, I know, okay? So let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So, you know, I've been very vocal here on the channel about my um, running journey. You know, how it started like 20, 25 years ago. Back, girl, when I was an undergraduate. And just like I said, I've kind of done this on again off again you know kind of pattern but y'all already know how much i love running so um back then even about two three years ago when i was running i was my endurance running i would do upwards of 10 15 miles my longest being 20 miles but i have always said and i think i even mentioned here on the channel that you know i've had this kind of go always in the back of my head you know like to do you know a marathon and then i'll be like i oh, know you know i'm not gonna worry about it and just like i said you know i have done a 20 miler before but here i go girl on youtube last night and i'm thinking you know what though girl if they're doing it you can do it too i mean Girl, if you've done 20 miles, why not, you know, train to do 26.2? Girl, I know, I know. Girl, I'm thinking, is this my time? And I already know, girl, y'all about to be hyping me up in these comments. Well, I know that's what we do. We hype each other up, okay, because we are best friends. But I am sitting over here thinking like, girl, is this your time to go ahead and crush this goal? Girl, okay, so here we go again. I'm down the rabbit hole. I'm just looking at all of these videos of these amazing women, amazing runners who are really getting it done. Now, when I say marathon, girl, you already know it's going to be right downstairs in my garage on my treadmill. But hey, girl, a marathon in my book is a marathon, right? So I know it's this app out there, Couch to 5K, but here's the thing. You know, it's Couch to 5K. Girl, I wouldn't even know where to really start training for a marathon, girl. I don't know. And and I'm not like trying to talk myself out of it because I'm just like, girl, we can get it figured out. And that's where you come in too, best friend, girl. We are in this thing together. Just like I said, when you click that subscribe button, girl, we are locked. So y'all going to help me out if we are really going to do it. And I'm going to take it a step further. So I'm just like, but when? When would I do this? So you already know, girl, my fit bursary is on um, on July 13th. It'll be my four-year fit bursary, July 13th. So I'm sitting on the couch yesterday 
yesterday and I'm thinking, you know what? What if, just what if my Fitversary is on a Saturday? Maybe I can do it. Girl, pulled up the calendar. Girl, I'm going to tell you, it is on a Saturday. I'm like, Lord, is this my confirmation that it's my time to go ahead and do this marathon? But then I was like, no, no, no. I don't want to do it on that Saturday because, girl, I want to be able to celebrate, you know, my Fitversary. So I'm like, what if, girl, just what if I did the marathon on that Friday? Because you already know, girl, I'm off on Fridays. I'm pretty sure it'll be the same you know what are we a little less than six months away my schedule will probably be around you know the same so I'm like okay so what if girl I set my date my marathon date to be July the 12th okay because here's the thing girl I don't want to run it on the 13th because after them 26.2 miles your girl probably girl, girl gonna be done okay but if I run it on that Friday and then on my on that Saturday July 13th that not only will be my fit bursary but also um I would be celebrating you know me running a marathon girl y'all tell me what y'all think about that it's just I guess in my mind you know giving me something to kind of work towards look you know work towards you know look forward to girl I don't know just got like said I, look we best friends okay so I just want girl I started not to even say anything but I'm just like no we can't do that because they're gonna be a part of the journey too and we're best friends so we share everything so I already know. Y'all gonna be hyping me up in the comments. Y'all just tell me what y'all think about that idea. Your girl training. I'm saying training, girl. You know, I don't know what I'm doing necessarily, but training for a marathon here in the next couple of months. And we make a big to-do um, about the marathon and then also my fit first rate. Girl, y'all let me know. So listen, that's all. Y'all see why I didn't want to get into it this morning, girl, because uh, yeah, that was gonna be too much, you know, to talk about before I left home. So no, girl, that's been my thoughts. Go ahead, check in. Let me know how your morning is going. Of course, I hope you're having the most amazing day. Your girl is about to sit here and catch on my chart, catch up on charts, girl, as usual. Okay, drink my water and um, yeah, we'll just see what the afternoon holds. But go ahead, check in, girl. I guess I'll be seeing you a little later on once I get home to eat my 500 calorie meal. Oh, and I don't think I mentioned this. Your nephew Braylon does have a basketball game on tonight as well. So no, girl, check in. All right, we'll be talking real soon. So I just got home girl and um yeah when i tell you i literally have about 30 45 minutes before it's time to go i worked so hard girl not only this morning but this afternoon as well but now i just came home because it's gonna be time to get to bring us the basketball game so i'm about to go ahead girl make a mad dash for it get everything that i need to get ready for in the morning like my workout clothes and scrubs and all those things put together um get braylon's little snacks together i'm about to go ahead girl make my little 500 calorie meal and um yeah we're gonna be out the door so if you don't see me again girl of course i'll just be back to show you my steps for the end of the day but of course i'll be showing you here in just a second what i'll be having for my 500 calorie meals this will be a down day oh girl i still gotta get my food ready to take to work tomorrow girl okay let me go ahead and go we'll be we'll be checking in real soon so here's my 500 calorie meal i'm going in with my cilantro lime rice and then also um with a side of my air fry zucchini girl i just put that in the air fryer on 370 for 11 minutes on tonight so i'm about to go ahead eat this food and then we are out of here we're headed to the game which wish, wish y'all's nephew good luck I have had the most amazing day from doing the things I enjoy to eating the foods I love. Go ahead in the comments, tell me one thing that has made your day amazing. Y'all already know what to do. Show your girls some love. Click the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a video from me. I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.